Today at Chat State with Kristen Anderson and Isabel Hatfield and Timothy Conley with your local weather. I'm Anderson and I'm Isabella Hatfield. So how's your first week of classes going so far? Um, pretty stressful. I made the mistake of doing a morning class and a night class in the same day. Oh, so. oh dang, then that's really got to stink, you know, just it's going to be a bad timing. First class is at 8, last class ends at like 8. <laughs> <laughs> What about you? Um, mine is just, uh, I only have classes two days a week, so <laughs> that's, that's all I've got going on right now. But yeah, I'm pretty excited about it. See, that's smart. Well, uh, speaking of school, here's some information you may have missed for the spring semester here at Chattanooga State. Be sure to register for Tiger Alert so you're always up to date with the latest news regarding inclement weather or campus emergencies. Sign up, sign up information is on the front page of your Tiger Web login. Just use the link at the bottom. It only takes a few minutes and will keep you updated for the rest of the semester. The Office of Student Life is where you go to get student IDs. The office hours of operation are 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. and appointments can be made on Calendly. Students will need to bring a valid ID like a driver's license or need to know their A number. Contact Dedrick Mayfit for more info. Another important date is January 31st. If you're planning on graduating this May, you won't want to miss this deadline. You need to declare your intent to graduate and review your graduation checklist and make sure you're all ready to go. You don't want to miss walking with your major in cap and gown, diploma in hand. Again, if you have any questions, see your advisor as soon as possible. Well, that's definitely a lot to keep up with when you think about it. Yeah, I totally have to agree with you, but I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of excited about graduation this semester. So. Me too. But Timothy, what's our weather looking like today? Well, it's rainy outside today and temperatures are cool in the 40s. We've got a lot of clouds over there, but they'll be moving east soon. Let's take a look at our seven-day forecast. High today with 53 degrees of, with rain, cloudy and cool on Friday, then sunny on Saturday, but cooler with uh, highs in the 50s and then we'll start seeing more showers starting Sunday with slightly warmer weather next week. Back to you. The week's biggest entertainment figure may not be a musician or an actor, but a poet. David Daniel has, has that and more in the Hollywood Minute. We will rise from the sun-baked south. We will rebuild, reconcile, and recover. The breakout star of the presidential inauguration was Amanda Gorman. The 22-year-old National Youth Poet Laureate performed her work The Hill We Climb, and her books immediately climbed the charts. Change Sings and The Hill We Climb poems shot to the top of the Amazon bestseller list, and they're not even scheduled to be published until September. And I'm here tonight to bring you all the news from across this great world of ours. News of the World is finding an audience. The Western drama starring Tom Hanks is the top-ranked movie on the streaming services Voodoo and Fandango Now. In second place on both charts, The Crude's A New Age, which is also faring well in theaters. I used to be loved. I used to be a kid detective. We're all really counting on you. I was so far ahead of the game. Then he grew up into Adam Brody, who stars in The Kid Detective as a former Encyclopedia Brown type who gets a chance to solve a real murder case. The Kid Detective is out this week on Blu-ray and digital platforms. Following the clues in Hollywood, I'm David Daniel. Somebody's testing me. Those movies look super interesting. I might have to check out a couple of them. I know, I agree. I'm kind of excited about the Kid Detective one. That's, that really looks like a funny movie to watch. It really does. Well, that's it for today at Chat State. Be sure to watch us online and in the amphitheater. Have a great day. Scene one, Apple Take Two. Scene one, Apple Take Two.